The sheriff's department called and told me I needed to come and secure the store with them. And I, when I showed up, I was like, how do you secure that? Security and certainty is what many East Texans are searching for as communities destroyed by long track tornadoes try to rebuild and recover. Today we were grabbing the more valuable items that we needed to get, um, especially the things so looters don't try to sneak in here and try to get because that's probably going to happen. Luckily, no lives were lost in Monday night's storms, but the structural damages are extensive. Like when she told me, hey, the store is gone, like it's damaged, it's bad. Now, I didn't think it was this extreme. Big's convenience store was just one of the buildings destroyed, a business owned by a local family and ran by dedicated employees. The storm hit last night at like 1033. Last employee was out at 915. Uh, everybody made it out. There was nobody left here. Everybody was safe. Um, except the store <laughs> and just a few feet away from that mom and pop shop. This is what's left cars crushed trees thrown about and power lines down. Norman Lane is one of the areas hit the hardest in Houston County. There's abandoned pets while people try to rebuild on the streets from the tornadoes that ripped through East Texas. It's just a kind of a wow, you know, moment <laughs> for CBS 19. I'm Colleen Campbell.